Hi guys, it's Dawn from Let's Make a Mess today. How are you doing tonight? Well, I hope everybody's doing okay. I'm just hopping online to show you something that I've done and I'm hoping that you'll like it. Um, basically, this is to introduce something that I'm planning on doing maybe maybe once a month, maybe once every couple months, maybe never again. I don't, it depends on how you guys like it or not. But I thought it would be a good way for me to kind of um, be able to send stuff to more people because um, the journals go like that online and I can't make those that fast. They take days. So this took today. Um, I worked. I started working on it last night. I sewed some of these little these little journals. That, um, I just sewed these little folders. And what I'm calling these are fun folders, okay? And so what this is is not a, well, it's kind of just a little supply folder with a bunch of goodies in it. And um, I don't want to call it a kit, but I mean it can be because this one um, has all kinds of stuff, vintage and floral and uh, love kind of as the theme and some Valentine's because Valentine's is right around the corner. So I kind of went that route because I was thinking, well, it is February and so I made everything kind of red and kind of floral, but I added other stuff too if you're not into that kind of stuff. So I don't know, so I'm, I'm kind of a theme but can really not be used as a theme. Everything in here can be used for your junk journaling or your art, anything and everything, including this wallpaper right here. It's got a nice little texture on it. You can use this um, in your, you know, or just keep it as a folder. So let's get started. So it's got quite a bit of stuff in it. Um, there's two, um, two, uh, all, you know, little paper clips here with one's got some. This is my favorite kind of yarn, you guys. This thick yarn, I love it. So I need some more. I only have this red, and I only have a blue, so I've got to buy some more. And then some uh, red lace, and everybody has the exact same thing. And what I did was, um, I made them not the exact same thing, the same thing, but maybe a little like some have blue and some have pink, and the the napkins are all a little different. And of course, jelly plants aren't exactly the same. But you, you know what I'm saying? So everything has the same item, but maybe a different color or size or, or, or whatever. So, um, yeah. So everybody has a, a, a heart doily because, again, it's Valentine's Day. And so now you know what I was making those jelly plate envelopes for. It was for you guys, right? So inside this envelope, I just put a few things for journaling, like some of these little journal cards. Yeah. Some of these journaling cards, um, a couple of paper, um, of these larger puzzles. Some of these things you'll notice are in my junk journal. So just a couple of these um, little Valentines and then these little tiny cards that go together from a game. I thought they were cute. Um, so it's called Typical Woman or Typical Man. I don't, they were man, I never, I didn't play the game, you guys. It's just something I found and I thought, oh, those are cute little cards. So you have that and you have your heart and you also everybody does have exactly one of these this napkin is different in everybody but everybody does have a valentine napkin now i also added this a piece of that jelly plate um cardboard that i made that you see me that you remember those squares that i did because i wanted everybody excuse me grace is getting to me these days now remember if you're allergic to cats you can't buy from me so i apologize in advance but this is a cat friendly home but, um, so yeah, and I thought this would be either great as a really big, one big tag, or you could make three small tags, or one, you know, two medium tags. I mean, so it's up to you, but this is, remember, this is for your art. This isn't, this isn't about me. And then, of course, a flower. Everybody has a flowery, um, uh, calendar page because, yeah, it's the floral thing, right? It's, let's go with romantic, okay? Let's not just say valentine -y. Let's just say romantic because um, you'll see why in a minute. So I picked romantic. Now everybody's gonna have one of these and let me explain this to you in a minute. It's kind of a, you'll see. And I put one of these owl um, library pockets in here. Oh, well let's just do this. So when I pack the rest of them up, this is what will be in here. There you go. That's perfect, was that not perfect? And then everybody will have a floral type of Valentine, or napkin and then a couple of uh, cards like a, this is like a date a recollection capturing special moments what but it's an index card and a time card and then on the romantic theme I went with the Jane Austen a couple of pages from Jane Austen so you'll, uh, you guys will all recognize Mr. Bennett and Elizabeth so that's the romantic theme and then this is a piece of um, just one piece each because I only have a few 
And if you can see this, this is wonderful, wonderful. This would be wonderful in art journaling, like a beautiful art page. And uh, so I, I added that in there for you. I added some Asian paper. And again, along with the um, romantic theme, I thought that French, oh, let me show you. First off, the Jane Austen came out of this book. So it's Jane Austen's Three Great Novels. I was gonna read it, but I can't read it now because there's pages missing, hello. And then look at this. This is a French dictionary. And I just thought, oh my gosh, ooh la la. So I am taking pages out of that. Yes, I know there's people out there that are cringing right now, but it's for good, it's for art's sake. And so there we go. And so this is all French. So I thought this would be pretty to decoupage some of these flowers on, right? Wouldn't that be beautiful? So you have that. And then a, a ledger paper. And everybody's going to get one of these postcards that I recently purchased. And the thing that I like about this, again, everything in here is for you to do art on. Look at this envelope, you guys. You can use this someplace and then do what I did with this envelope here. You can jelly plate this or paint it or whatever you want to do. So that you'll that's just wonderful. So it's a, a great sized envelope. Then I added three sheets of deli paper because jelly, I noticed that a lot of people are really getting into jelly plating now, yay! And, um, oh, and I heard today that um, jelly just came out with a 12 by 12, is it, you guys? Oh my gosh, that is one big jelly plate, which is great because my eight by 10, you always cut off one side of the sheet. So that is wonderful. So there you have that, and there's that. Uh, this is the seam binding. Everybody's getting one of those. You'll either get a pink or a blue. And then, so you'll have that. And then, again, isn't that cute? You can just leave your... And then one side of double-sided. This is kind of a... Uh, uh, everybody's getting a floral, and it's double-sided, and it's kind of one of those thicker cardstocky kind, but not too thick. And then a an original Sears and Roebuck page out of the, an original... Um, um, catalog that somebody gifted me. You know who you are. Thank you very much. And then everybody's getting a, pic, a, a copy, a page, an original page out of a parade um, page out of the uh, parade uh, sewing book. Isn't this gorgeous? I mean, these are beautiful images in and of themselves, you guys. So take a copy and, and um, reuse those. Because you can. This is vintage, okay? Patterns were 35 cents plus each plus 10 cents per pattern for first class mailing. Wow. So that's some vintage. And then I wanted to include a, um, can you see this? It's a transparency. Because I've noticed some people doing windows on there in their um, art journals. And I thought, well, we all need a window. So here's a window for your art journaling. And then each person is going to get a picture of a, um, uh, um, something out of a love book. So this is like a love, you know, a love. See, they're married and going off, and I don't know what it's all about, but it's, it looks like he's got paint, and she's got a fan. It might be a dream or something. But yeah, this is out of a love book, and see, these guys are hugging. Two rocks hugging. Mm-hmm. I think that's really romantic, don't you? Anyway, so the, there's that. And then again, some music so that you can um, decorate your, uh, you can decoupage, again, on the music sheet and using this beautiful row, uh, which comes, it's the full thing. So yeah, and there's, they're not, again, they're not all the same, but they're all just as pretty. So there's that, one more thing, and this, you guys, is a surprise. Now, I went through and I made sure that there's something really cool in here. There's a there's a bunch of little really cool things in here, but I think getting a surprise is fun. And so I'm gonna leave it like that. I could take it open and there's a little plastic bag in here so that when you do open it, it doesn't spill all over, just so you know. Because I'm notoriously really bad about just putting a bunch of little things and stuff like this and then you open it and then it goes all over the floor and for that I apologize. I did buy some little bags and <laughs> so that doesn't happen to you. So anyway, so everybody's gonna get one of these. And so these are going to be, by the time I, I'm gonna put them on my Etsy shop and, and I'm also bought this, 
scale today that will help me um, figure out how I'm going to start using this scale because I've only been doing junk journals and they're just, you know, $7 to because I use one of those legal sized envelopes, but I don't want to put $7 on this. I think this is going to be, I don't know, I'd say because it's flat and I can keep it flat. I think it might be more like three or four dollars, but I'm not sure. So anyway, I hope you enjoy this kit. And um, if you think I can add, you know, other things to it, let me know. Um, but I hope that you like them. And if you do, then I'll be making more. Um, so anyway, I'll talk to you guys real soon. Okay, let me know how you like these. Okay, talk to you later. Bye, guys.